Frontier keeps teasing us with what's to come in Jurassic World Evolution 2. Just last week in the Hide and Seek Gallimimus post, we spotted a DFW zipline and literal trash. But this post also brings the possibility of having an open exhibit where guests can roam freely through an enclosure with probably herbivores inhabiting it. This is exciting because it brings a new opportunity of how your guests can experience your parks and maybe there will be a way to do carnivals i don't know because they released an image a while ago about this but let's get on to today's news because they released an image of a new feathered dinosaur which is very exciting and it doesn't match the tail of any other feathered species currently in the game like oviraptor or pararaptor this image not only confirms that there will be a dlc coming to the game but it's maybe later than expected but it brings new dinosaurs and it's probably a paid dlc and in that case it brings a couple new creatures to the game but i think the feathered creatures currently in the game have been brilliantly executed by frontier and i did make a video previously predicting what the future dlc might look like like hybrids I think I said and missing camp, camp cretaceous species like it like tarbosaurus by spinoceratops nodosaurus nothosaurus or smilodon but it doesn't look like any of those I don't think but this does not confirm that there won't be a camp cretaceous DLC in the future. It just might be coming at a later date because they're releasing new species that aren't in the Jurassic universe. We can tell this is a new creature due to the plumage of the tail and how the feathers are localized around the tip alongside the new striped pattern running down the tail. The creature looks entirely feathered though there isn't much to go on as it's just the tip of the creature's tail. And I have quite a few predictions of what it could be. It, I think it could be either Dinocaris, Euteraptor, or maybe Ornithomimus. And I can't wait for the upcoming trailer and more teasers that they do because I, I can't wait. Maybe they'll release a, um, another one of those sounds that they did because I remember they did that for Atrociraptor. But it probably won't be as noticeable because it hasn't been in a Jurassic movie but can't wait for more teasers and i hope you guys enjoyed this short video covering the new update i know i didn't do one last week but if you want comment down below what you think this creature could be and your predictions of what the other creatures could be because i think it's a pack that could contain four to three creatures i'm presuming like the last ones but in the last one they had two land creatures and then a flyer and a aquatic creature but tell me who this tale belongs to see you guys in the next one Bye -bye. <laughs>